Hey everyone, Rob here with another episode of Modern Caveman. Uh, earlier this afternoon I had done a video looking at the Light My Fire as well as looking at the Magnesium Fire Starters. And as I was going through cleaning some stuff up, I came across this piece of fire starting kit uh, called Fire Lighters. An incredibly original name. <laughs> Uh, very imaginative, and this is by Koglins as well. The the magnesium fire starter that I that I showed in the earlier video is from Koglins, and this is another product that is distributed by Koglins. And what it is, I believe it when I checked this before, these are actually made in Africa. believe they are. Pretty sure I saw it on there someplace. Yeah, they're made in, I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if I can probably not get it in there. Nah, whatever. Well, they're made, it's saying that they're made in South Africa. And apparently they're old, odorless very easy to light, which they are. Uh, says that the burn time for these is approximately seven minutes. And I'm trying to see what if it has what they're made out of or what they're impregnated with, but I don't see that. But when you look at these guys, let me get one out here. This is what it looks like. It kind of looks like a like an impregnated cardboard. They just took, kind of looks like they took over, took leftover, thrown away corrugated cardboard and processed it and, you know, just smushed it all together. It's, you know, somewhat pliable. And you have a, uh, you know, it looks like a big, beefy match. And when you light these things, which I'll show you in a second, uh, these things really go up. And they burn for for quite a while, like they said, about seven minutes, but it puts up such a strong flame that you'll have no problem getting a fire started very quickly. So uh, it comes with a 20 in here. I've actually gone through and broken these in half and frayed it up and lit it with... Uh, with a light my fire and uh, it works fairly well but these things that they're not you know for, for how they burn and how they ignite uh, no residue nothing off of it it's not sticky it's not you know moist in any way uh, it's just kind of pliable and you know kind of a cardboard type material to them uh, but uh, yeah no a great little piece just curious if you guys have ever seen these? I mean, they're not that expensive. If I recall, it's only, geez, I don't know. It can't be any more than $5. I'd be surprised if it even reaches $5. Uh, but they're fantastic. You know, if, if it's kind of wet, miserable, what have you, or just, you know, after a long day, you don't want to sit and, you know, work on, a, on really getting your fire together. Just, uh, you know, get some small twigs and stuff and light one of these suckers up and you're good to go so what I'm going to do is uh, shut you guys off here for a second and I'm going to go outside and light one of these puppies up just to show you how they look so be alright guys here I am and here's the the match, the fire lighters right here. So I'm going to shut the light off and uh, strike it. You have the striker on the side of the box as well. That's why I keep it in a Ziploc bag, preserve that striker. So uh, let me shut my light off here and show you how it looks.
said, it definitely puts off when you strike it real good flame. So you're creeping along. It has pretty good flame to it. The It'll last quite a while. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut one in half and try out with the light my fire fire steel. So as you can see, these are pretty pretty good for uh, lighting up your fires. So I'll be back. So here it is where I took it and. and tore it up a little bit took the piece, pieces, took it apart trying to get the frayed pieces out so let's put the uh... light my fire on that and see see how it goes So it just goes to go to just to show you guys that you can kind of use it as a uh, as a vaseline impregnated cotton ball as well if, if the uh, if the uh, match heads get wet and fall off you can still use your your light my fire or fire steel or whatever you have on you to to, uh, to get these things going so but uh, Marty came in out.